so my book, um, The Gospel of Falling Down, which was written before I'd come across Dudism, I think is probably a Dudist book because it's precisely about this message that we learn more from being at the bottom than we do from being at the top. We learn more certainly about spirituality, about ourselves, about God, by falling from the ladder of perfection rather than climbing it. You know, Christianity can be, or religion in general, can be quite damaging when it puts us on this, this so-called ladder of, um, of seeing the goal somewhere away from here and now. You know, it's, it's at the top of this, this ladder or over there, you know, at the end of um, a, a massive journey. The fact is we do need to journey in order to find the treasure, but actually we find that it was with us all along. And there's so many metaphors and myths from all sorts of cultures that tell that story. You know, the book The Alchemist contains that truth. A um, story called The Rabbi's Gift. Uh, the Wizard of Oz probably does. You know, so. Um, but the thing is, when when we when in Christianity, when we when we make it a, a pursuit of perfection and success, which is impossible anyway, we just I think put ourselves on an eternal conveyor belt of misery. Really, you know, how can we truly love ourselves when we see the goal always is over there, and and the picture of ourselves as being somebody different to who we are. Um, it's my experience, and I, and I know when I say this, um, when I talk like this, some people disagree and say, well, that's not my experience of Christianity. Well, fine, you know, it works for a lot of people, and that's great. Um, you know, hardline, um, perfectionistic Christianity probably does work for a, a lot of people, but for a lot it doesn't, and I've met them, and since leaving the established world of the church and being far more out on the edges of society, I've come across people time and time and time again who've been hurt, damaged, wounded 